Yes, so this is our TCL Nextwear Air. Okay. It's a super cool product. You're looking at a XR display. So it's not AR nor is it VR. XR, think XR X-ray. It's content that you can see, but it's translucent, so you can see through it, of course. Uh -huh. So it's a 140 inch screen, which I said it's four meters away. It's a 1920 by 1080 resolution with a 16 by 9 aspect ratio, a 47 degree field of view with a 60 foot screen. So currently you're looking through it, of course. You can kind of still see me and the rare variable surrounding. Now if I go ahead and swap this one. So this is um, our standard breaker lens. It comes with the product upon purchase. It magnetically attaches and it's going to give you a little bit more intimate connection to the content that you're consuming. Oh yeah. And of course this is fully tethered. So it is powered by the device. So whether it's connected to a phone or a PC uh, or like a Mac, anything that's USB-C coming to lightning uh, dongles as well um, or display port as well. So then that, um, will give you that productivity element. You'll have a 140 inch screen connected to your computer. However, you can still see your keyboard and mouse. <laughs> but it does get cool. So it also supports 3D content. I just launched a 3D content there for you. Okay. Uh, sold separately, we, we have our cinematic experience blackout lens. Okay. This is going to give you full content immersion to that 140 inch screen. Integrated audio as well, so built into the temple pieces is that beaming audio. Um, additionally, if you want to increase the audio quality, you can connect any Bluetooth headset, of course. Very neat. Very neat. Works with Android and Apple devices? Yes, so anything that's USB-C um, and or coming to Lightning as well. Oh, is this already on market? It is not quite yet, so we're launching it. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I forget you're blacked out and then I like reach at you. <laughs> um, but it is, our goal is we are launching this globally this year in quarter one. Okay. Uh, we haven't announced the price quite yet. Okay. We're actually using to see it, or we're using the CES experience to ask two questions. How much do you think it would be and what would you pay for? Oh, you totally can. You don't have to. Mm. <laughs> Good question. Well, I've seen and real uh, headset. It seems similar in that you have the phone sort of taking some of the uh, reach. So, $500, $700. Okay. Awesome. And stay tuned for press releases, of course. Definitely. <laughs>